Hi, can you tell me how much this is? Uh, it looks like that'll be $5.99. Okay, never mind. Did you not want it? Oh, no, I'm a dollar short, so maybe next time. You know what? Don't worry about it. It's on me. Just have a good day. Wait, really? Are you sure? Thank you. It's seriously not a problem. I know times are tough right now. You are so sweet. Thank you. I can take whoever's next. Oh, I see we're giving out free handouts now. No. Oh, right. And how do I get free stuff too? Not that it's any of your business, but I happen to know that that woman is homeless and the least I could do is spare her a dollar. Aw, how charitable. And does the manager know that you're giving stuff away for free? Okay, that's definitely not what's going on because I think they'd be very interested to know that an employee is stealing from them. Your total is twelve fifty seven. Oh, you're not gonna cover my bill. Your total is twelve fifty seven. I'm still waiting for my discount. <laughs> I need security to the front. I got a woman trying to shoplift. Excuse me, hi. I had a flight that was supposed to leave at seven fifty one, but it's not at the gate. Oh well, it is currently nine oh seven, so it looks like you missed it. Okay, but I, I was supposed to be on that flight, so I don't, I don't, is it normal for you to just abandon your clients? Hmm, well, it does look like we tried to contact you several times. Would you like me to replace your ticket for the same destination? Well, after this, I don't know if I still want to go. Oh, okay, no problem. I can go ahead and cancel that. Well, maybe I want to go somewhere else now. Oh, no problem. Where would you like to I want to go somewhere better. I want to go to the Grand Canyon. Okay, yeah, I can definitely uh, switch your ticket to Arizona. I didn't say Arizona. I said the Grand Canyon. Yes, of course, but you do have to still fly to an airport in Arizona. You can't just fly directly to the Grand Canyon. Okay, whatever. Okay, and it looks like there will be an increase to the price. We're just exchanging tickets here. It shouldn't cost me a dime. Well, I could have exchanged the original ticket, but then you... Well, when's the next flight to Margaritaville? I'll just go there. That... You know what? It's leaving right now. Let me get you on that flight. Hi, I just got the bill from when I stayed at your hotel, and I want to know why you charged me $4,000 in miscellaneous fees. Sure, what was the name? The name is Chanel C. Lewinsky. Let me see here... Okay, it looks like you took all of the items out of the room, so we did have to charge you for all of the items that you took. I didn't take anything that wasn't mine. I paid for that room. Well, according to what I have listed here, you took our curtain, sheets, comforter, shower curtain, pillow, television, alarm clock, Bible, telephone, minibar, hair dryer, robes, lampshades, and interestingly enough, part of the carpet? Hold on, I did not call this number to be accused of being a theft, okay? I was a guest at your hotel, and I took what was rightfully mine. Right, but ma'am, you can't steal our furniture. You can use the complimentary items like the soap. I travel all the time and I've never been to a hotel that has this policy. Right, well, you can bring everything back or we can just charge it to your account. <laughs> if I bring it back, it's coming back smashed. Okay, no problem. It sounds like you just want to charge everything to your account, so I'll go ahead and do that now. So you're the theft. And I'll do the four cheese pizza. Okay, did you want to add any meat on that pizza? No, no meat. I'm a vegetarian. And also, I'm allergic to dairy, so I can't have any of that either. Okay, wait, but you ordered a four cheese pizza. Yes, I like the herbs and oils that come on it, but no cheese. Okay, do you want to replace or add anything? No, I don't want to make it too complicated. Okay, that'll be out shortly. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, how is everything? Yeah, there's no flavor to this pizza. Well, there is nothing on it. I don't think that's it. Maybe can I get some Parmesan? Yeah, but are you sure that'll be okay though? Oh yeah, it should be fine. Okay, yeah, be right back. Excuse me, why is there dairy on this? How could you be so irresponsible? Are you serious? I told you I'm severely allergic to cheese and now I just invested it because of you. Okay, wait, no, not because of me. Oh my God, just bring me a chicken parm. I think I'm losing my mind. Hi, did you find everything okay? I sure did, but that's because I come here all the time. Wait, how much did those ring up for? Uh, it looks like $14.99. Wait, what? I, that's more than I thought it would be. Okay, did you still want it? Oh, no, don't worry. I know how to handle this, don't worry. So actually, I've seen that exact same pair of pants at Marshall's and they were a lot cheaper. Okay, so did you not want them? Well, don't you want to match the price? Oh, I can't do that. I'm sorry. How about this? We do it for $4.99. That sounds like a good deal, huh? I can do that. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. No, we don't bargain here. Whatever the price tag says it is, I, I can't change that. I'm sorry. Well then, ma'am, it looks like you just lost another customer. No problem. Have a nice day. Y you just lost my service. I'm, I'm not going to buy it. I, I'm not. Oh, no problem. Did you need help finding the way out? We're leaving and we're not buying anything. I wish you would. We're going to tell all of our friends about this. Oh, honey, make sure you keep that window shade closed. I got astigmatism and I'm afraid of heights. So, uh, oh, when are we going to get our meals? There won't be a meal, but you're welcome to choose from any of our complimentary snacks. Uh, no, because those people up there got their meals and I want to know when I get mine. I want a hot sandwich. The sandwiches are for our first class flyers only. I don't understand. I've been waiting all week for this. I've been fasting because I heard you have the best sandwiches. This is classist. Like I said, complimentary snacks will be coming around shortly. So what, like crackers? I, I don't think so. I need to, I need to speak to your pilot now. 
Oh, I'm afraid that won't be an option. Can I get you anything else? So just because I can't afford first class means I don't get the same privileges as first class, like a hot sandwich. You're welcome to bring your own food. No, mm -mm, I want that one. And while you're at it, get me a Cosmo and make it a double. Let me see what I can do. Yeah, thank you. Okay, here's your food and your drink. Now, since you did order a first class meal, would you like me to charge the $200 to your account or do you have a card? Party of 10, okay. It looks like we can seat you in about 45 minutes. Oh, no, no, I see an open table right there. We'll take that one. Oh, no, I'm sorry, that table's not available. Oh, it's okay. There's no one sitting over there and we don't wanna wait 45 minutes. Are you guys ready? No, no, I'm sorry, that table's actually been reserved for a party that put in their reservation a few weeks ago. Well, they're not here and we are, so what's the issue? There is no issue. That table is unavailable and our wait time is 45 minutes. <laughs> you don't get to tell us where we can and cannot sit. That's not how this works here. No, that's exactly how it works. I'm the hostess of this restaurant. <laughs> don't you just greet people? Do you mind stepping aside? There's people trying to get to the front here. Yes, party of two? No problem, come with me. Excuse, oh, uh, wait, wait. You're still here? You had the audacity to sit them before us and make us wait 45 minutes? You know what? I think I made a mistake. Huh, no kidding. I'm so sorry, the wait is actually an hour and 45 minutes. I'll be posting on Yelp about this. Okay, your total is 32.43. Go ahead and pull up to the next window. Oh, you forgot the manager discount. We don't have that. Okay, well, I get half off every time I order here because I know the manager. Which manager? It shouldn't really matter. It kind of does. You're asking for a 50% discount. Well, this has never been an issue for me before, and I come here almost once a week, so I'm not sure what the problem is. Yeah, I've worked here for five years. I've never heard of a manager discount, and I don't know who the hell you are. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. I misspoke. It's because I'm a manager that I get a discount. That's what it is. Okay, you're a manager of what? I'm a shift lead at Claire's, so I get a manager discount here? That has nothing to do with our establishment. What are you talking about? Is it really that hard just for you to type in 50% off on your little keypad there? What is the problem? Tell you what I can do. I can delete half of what you ordered, so now it's half the cost. That seems like a scam. Oh, perfect, thank you. And your name is Sam, right? Oh, yeah. I do this thing every week called the Venmo Challenge where tons of people will send in money and then vote for the most hardworking employee. And you won this week, so this is a $1,000 tip to say thank you. Are you serious? I don't even know what to say. Wait, what's going on? What'd you get? It's just a little something to recognize all of her hard work here. Okay, and this money is to be split among everyone working tonight, right? Oh, no, I'm sorry. This is just for her. We actually had people vote in and- Whoa, 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 okay? I'm also struggling. Yes, ma'am, a lot of people are. That's what we're trying to rec- Beep? Absolutely not. I am a mother of six, so any argument you are coming up with is invalid. I am automatically more deserving than a single student, okay? I am a mother of six. Well, ma'am, you chose to have that many children. Doesn't matter. What about me? Well, cross your fingers. They'll vote you in next time. I can see why they haven't yet. Sam, I really think you should give that cash to the person it belongs to. Oh, thank you for admitting. I should keep it. Oh, hi there. Are you ready to place your order? Are you serious? I was just here yesterday. You don't remember me? Um, I'm sorry, I don't. I see a lot of people every day, so no. <laughs> well, that's rude. I just want to let you know that we're very unhappy with our experience here yesterday. Oh no, what was the problem? Well, my son just got home from college on a break. You see, he's an honor student, and his favorite thing in the world is your anchovy pizza. And when we ordered it yesterday, it was appalling. I'm sorry to hear that. Do you want me to put in another order? No, in fact, I don't think we'll ever eat here ever again. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for letting me know. I'm sorry that that happened. I don't want your apology. The one you should be apologizing to is my son. He's in the car crying right now. He's crying? Mm-hmm. So what are you going to do to make this better? Well, like I said, I can put in another order or we can- I don't want another order, girly. You know what? That's it. I'm suing this place. I'm contacting my lawyer now. Oh, can you also ask them if they can help get us a higher wage or like more PTO hours or something? No, I can't. Aw. All right, I gotta go. I'll miss you. Bye. Aw, are you her older sister? Oh, no, no, no. That's my daughter. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. You just- Wow, you look like sisters. You're just so young. Do you mind me asking how old you are? Yeah, I'm 21. My goodness, you had her when you were 18? Yup. Oh my goodness. Well, I hope your parents are around to help. That's a lot of work for a young girl like you. No, they live in another state, actually. Oh, wow, bless your heart. No support. What about your husband? Does he work? I don't have a husband. In fact, it's just me and her, and we're lucky to have each other, so. Oh, Lord have mercy. Well, I hope you're not doing anything crazy to get money. You are responsible for someone's life now, so appreciate the advice, although I did just graduate from college and I've been maintaining my job for over three years now, so. Great, and they're aware of your situation? I don't know, what's my situation? I mean, wait, your kid is the one that's always screaming at the guidance counselor that he hates his family, right? You know what you're gonna order? 
Uh, oh my god. I think I forgot my wallet again. No. Really? That sucks. I know. I always do this and I'm so hungry. You know what? I can cover it. It's not a big deal. Don't worry. Wait, really? Oh my god, thank you. I'll get like the teeniest thing on the menu and I'll totally Venmo you like extra. It's okay. Just get whatever you want. Seriously. <sighs> thank you. Hi, can I please get three turkey and Swiss subs? Can I also get four ham and provolone? Can I get a buffalo chicken wrap and a ranch wrap and then four sweet teas? Wow, you're really hungry. <laughs> Oh no, these are for the ladies back at the office. I'm not really a deli person. So then why did we pick here for lunch then? The office ladies suggested it. They just love the aesthetic. Okay, yeah, and are they chipping in for their orders or how is this gonna work? No, 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 I told them lunch was on me. Okay, I only agreed to pay for you because I didn't want to eat alone, but now there's all these other people and I- Yeah, and by getting lunch for me, you're getting lunch for them. Let's just sit down and we can figure this out. Oh, I actually got this all to go, but I'll see you later though. I'm eating all your food. Who are you? Oh, my name is Sam. It's my first day. What can I get you? Oh, um, odd. I'll be getting my regular. Oh, um, I'm sorry. I'm new, so I don't know what your order is. <sighs> well, can you just go ask the girls in the back then? Or you could just tell me what it is. Oh, whoops. I don't think you're in any position to be talking to an executive coffee drinker like myself, so go get the girls. Okay, there's no one in the back. It's just me. What can I get you? <sighs> Did you say this was your first day? Because it's about to be your last. Go get a manager. Be right back. That little girl does not know who she's messing with. Ugh, not this woman again. Hi, how can I help you? Oh, thank God you're here. This new girl is targeting me and she's refusing to give me my order. She won't even tell me her order. Well, I made my request and you refused. So, so what is your order? Well, Tammy, you should know. I'm a regular here. Yeah, we have a lot of regulars. Tammy, don't make me call corporate again. Hi, is this line open? No, I just closed this register. I think there's one open down there though. Okay, well, can you open please? No, I'm sorry. I just took all the money out of the register, so I can't. Oh, well, then I won't pay by cash. I'll pay by debit. I'll make your life easier. So if you could just ring me up real quick. Okay, so what I mean when I say no, I'm not open is that no, I'm not open. But there is an open register down there. What do you mean by no? What do I mean? I, I mean no. I mean no, you can't check out here. You can't check out here. No. But I already put all my stuff down. Yes, and would you like a basket so you can bring it to a register that is open? <laughs> Well, this store is just confusing. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Am I supposed to go up, down, here, there, where? So you go to the lines with the big light-up signs that say open. You know, okay, who is your boss? Your mom. What? I said your mom. My mom works here? I No, I'm sorry. I don't know why I said that. I'm losing my mind. I'm calling the police. I need a new room as soon as possible because mine smells like cat pee. Oh, I'm so sorry. What room? Room 112. I would like myself and all of my personable belongings escorted out of the room, but do not touch anything. Yeah, no problem. I'm so sorry. The room was cleaned before you came in, so I just don't understand. <sighs> yep, this is an embarrassment. I did Facebook Live everything, so all of Rhode Island did hear about this. Okay, so I do have a room available. Um, it looks like it's on the floor right above you. Sorry, I'm hearing things. Um, perfect. <clears throat> Weird question. Do you have a cat? Uh, yes. I see. Okay, ma'am, we do not allow pets at our hotel. Well, that's ridiculous. Why not? Well, we wouldn't want the rooms to smell like cat pee. Well, that chick's got her dog over there. Oh, uh, well, you see, that's a service animal, so that's not just her pet. Okay, so just because her dog was in the military means it gets special treatment? No, it didn't serve in the military. It's a service animal. Well, my cat was in the Air Force. Hi, is it just one tonight? No, it'll actually be a party of six. I'm just here early. Okay, perfect. Just let me know when the rest of your party gets here and then we can seat you, okay? Ooh, I was hoping you could actually seat me now. You see, I got here early because I know you guys get super busy and we really want to claim our spot. Oh, well, we actually need at least half of your party to be here before we can seat you, but you're more than welcome to wait at the bar or the high tops. No, you see, I'm here so I can claim the whole table for everybody. Well, technically your group isn't actually here yet and we can't just have people taking up tables. Unfortunately, we're really busy tonight, so I don't like that policy. Me either. I, I'm sorry, I can't change it. It's just... Well, I, I don't know what to do now. I guess I have to call them and, and let them... Yeah, where are you guys? No, we can't get a table. I can't do it. She's not letting me. I guess they changed the policy. I don't know. Like I said, you're more than welcome to wait at our bar. I am eight months sober, so thanks. Thanks for reminding me of that. Appreciate it. The bar has water. Yeah, no, I'll take a gin and tonic. <laughs> oh, excuse me. The end of the line is actually way back there. Oh, I know. I just don't have time for that long line. I just have to ask a quick question. I'll be really fast. Oh, no, I'm sorry. That's not how this works. Oh, well, you see, I'm in a hurry, so... Okay, and I get that. I was also in a hurry, but I had to wait in this line, so you're gonna have to do the same thing. <sighs> you're not gonna do me a favor? No, I don't even know you. 
Well, haven't you heard of a random act of kindness? Yeah, but if it's being demanded, it's not very random. Well, it won't kill you to help out a stranger now, will it? So if you'll just let me be. Okay, but it's not just affecting me. It's affecting every single person in this line that's been waiting. The answer is no. Okay, well, I don't have time for that. And I don't have time for this. <laughs> Do you even know what it's like to have arthritis? What? Exactly. You should really consider what other people are going through before you're rude to them. Okay, I'm gonna say this once. I have very hot coffee and I'm not afraid to use it. Why are you personally attacking me? Excuse me? Yeah, excuse me. You. Um, why are you sweeping and cleaning in front of my table? That's so disgusting. Oh, I'm sorry. I can move over here if you'd like. We just have to sweep the floor after the end of each shift. I don't know why you'd think this is a good idea to do right now. You're going to make me lose my appetite. I hear you. We just also have to make sure the restaurant stays clean throughout the day. I don't care. Why are you arguing with me? I'm the customer here. If I say I don't like it, you don't do it. I'm sorry, but like I said, at the end of each shift, we- Marlon, I don't care if you have to stay here and wait for us to finish our meal all night. You're not sweeping in front of me. Hey, Sarah, can you grab me the extra large garbage bags? There's a ton of trash at this table. I won't be paying for this meal. They haven't even made your meal yet, so just go. Oh, pardon me. I see that you have a lot of items and I only have these few things. I'm kind of in a rush. Can I skip ahead of you? Um, yeah, that's fine, I guess. Oh, bless your heart. Thank you. Yeah, it's no problem. Oh, Harold, over here. I got us a spot in line. Excuse me, my husband has a few more things. Yep, right over here. I see ya. Pardon me, darling. That's a lot more than just a few things. Oh, we'll be really fast. Wait, Amberjack, baby, get over here. Mommy's been looking everywhere for you. Where have you been? Mom, can I get the new Nerf Fortnite blaster? <laughs> no, you cannot. Mmm, please? I really, really want it. All right, all right, just go get it. I don't care. He'll be a moment. He's so sweet. <laughs> Seriously? Let's see, I want to try a couple of these cards. I'm not sure how much are on them. They should have like three bucks. Mom, I can't find it. It was declined. All right, try this one. Jackie, baby, I don't know what to tell you. This is what I get for being nice. All right, you folks can follow me right this way to your table. Oh, no, no, we'd actually prefer a booth. Well, um, actually, we did have one just open up. It may not be totally ready yet, but you can follow me this way. Oh, thank God. All right, here we are. Thank you. Ooh, this table's all sticky. I need someone to come clean this. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. They probably haven't had time to come clean it. Give me one moment, okay? Well, why'd she sit us here if it wasn't ready? <laughs> sorry about that. Thank you so much for your patience. All right, so tonight your server is going to be- Hold on, I'm sorry. This section over here still has a little bit of wetness on it. Yep, that's because I just wiped it down, but no worries, I can get more paper towels. You know, I'm probably allergic to that spray she put on the table. All right, let me just get that extra spot. Excuse me. All right, so tonight we're going- Hey, do you know Caitlin? Is she working tonight? We want to sit in her section. Yeah, she is, but her section's actually really full right now. Oh, it's all right. She already knows our orders. We love her. No, I'm sorry. There she is. I see her. No offense or anything. Oh, I thought I saw new neighbors. Yeah, hi. We just moved in yesterday. Oh, how fun. Well, I just wanted to stop by and introduce myself. My name is Mary Elizabeth Crusader. I live right across the street over there, that big one. If you need anything, don't ever hesitate to ask, okay? Oh, well, thanks so much. It was nice meeting you. Oh, and I did just want to point out to you that your mail box is a bit dirty and the neighborhood does require that there is less than four specks of dirt on our mailbox at all times so you will have to take care of that soon oh um yeah i'll get on that that's kind of the last thing i was oh i get it i totally get it but i also wanted to let you know that you have red mulch chips that are protruding into the grass and that is a big no-no you'll have to take care of that too Okay, that seems ridiculous. Are, are you like neighborhood watch or something? I, oh no, I'm just a friendly neighbor. Also, I need you to have your lights off in your home by 10 p.m. every night. Okay, so these rules aren't real. These are just your weird guidelines. Okay. Well, I do have the most tenure in this neighborhood. That's why they call me the neighborhood veteran. So it is expected that you do what I ask. Right, okay. So I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm not gonna do that. It looks like your card didn't go through. Do you mind running it again? I already put my card away. Can you just figure it out, please? Well, the issue is with your card, not the computer, so no. Um, it's not the card. I just used it at Sephora and it worked fine. Well, maybe it just had a weird error. So can you swipe it again, please? Oh my god, fine. Mm, yeah, for some reason it's still not going through. Oh well, that's not my problem. It's not mine either. Is there another card you could try? Nope. Okay, so now the issue is I don't have time for whatever issue you're having. I have to meet my daughter at the food court. Well, as of right now, you haven't actually purchased anything, so you can't take this with you. You're going to punish me because you don't know how technology works. Listen, I've worked here a long time. And okay, so then why are you having so many issues? Because the fact that you're trying to buy something from me without money is an issue. Excuse me, I do have money. This is my husband's card. Well, he must have cut you off because you ain't got nothing on that card. Excuse me, I need some help over here. Hi there, what can I help you with? Oh, I just need some help getting this item off the shelf. Okay, yeah, I'll go get the step stool. Oh, no, it's right there. It's eye level. I just need you to grab it. Oh, yeah, no problem. Sorry, I thought you couldn't reach it. Um, 
Here you go. Mm, no, I don't want this one. It isn't the right color. Sorry, that was the one you pointed to. No, I need you to get me another one from the back. Oh, well, actually, we don't have any of these left in the back. Everything we have is on the shelf right now. Now, darling, I know that's just what people say when they don't want to go get it, but I really need you to go get it. No, you see, I've actually had several people ask me for this particular toy, and I've had to go look in the back like three times, and there's nothing. Marlon, I really hope you don't think that I'm stupid, because my brother came down to this exact Walmart about a week ago, and he got his item from the back, so where's mine? Well, if it was a different day, we probably- Do you think that I don't know how your job works? You are here to help me, sugar, so go help me. One moment. Thank you, ma'am. Get out! Oh my! Just a quick question, why does my bill say you're charging me for two margaritas? Oh, because you ordered two margaritas. Yeah, they were buy one, get one free. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. We actually don't have any specials on our drinks right now. Uh, well, when I was here for Black Friday, they were definitely buy one, get one free. So I think you should honor that. Did you say Black Friday, like of 2020? Because it's January of 2021 and that sale is long gone. I'm so sorry. Well, why didn't you tell me that before I ordered them? Well, could you at least show me on the menu where it led you to believe that they were buy one, get one? Because maybe it's not on this menu. It was on that other one. What other one? The one from Black Friday? Okay, those menus don't even exist anymore. Okay, well, what can you cop from my bill to make up for this? Nothing. I'm sorry, you're expecting me to pay for everything I ordered? Yes. I can take whoever's next. Mm. Sorry, I just got so thirsty in that long line, I had to grab a water. Oh, that's no problem, I can just ring it up. Oh, no, this water should be complimentary since I had to wait in that long line. Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am, those actually weren't free, so if you did open anything from our store, I do have to ring it up. Well, I've never heard of that. Okay, well, I'm telling you now, you do have to pay for it. Okay, well, my doctor told me that I have to stay hydrated, and I was in that line so long, I had to grab water. You're more than welcome to take anything from the store. You just have to pay for it. Fine, whatever, but I'm not paying for these crackers. They were disgusting. You opened those and tried them? Yeah, I sure did, and they were disgusting, so can you put them back? No, you have to pay for those, too. W what? I'm sorry, is this your first time in a grocery store? Then how am I supposed to know what I like? I need samples. I don't know, I guess that's just a risk you're gonna have to take. So I can try on clothes, but I can't try your food? Okay, I'm confused why you're confused. 